Hello everyone, welcome to IoT Frontier. This is Hariharna. If you followed my one of the previous video, I freshly installed Raspberry Pi OS 32 bit with Bookworm 12 version on my Raspberry Pi board. Now, in this video, we'll look into how to install Node Red on Raspberry Pi OS. So, stay tuned until the end of this video to get all the steps right. This is the documentation of Node Red to install Node Red on Raspberry Pi. So, here we can see there is a prerequisite that it should be having Raspberry Pi OS. So, Wolf I is the currently supported version and we are using Bookworm, but it should be supporting. So, let's see that. And it has clearly given this command. So, this is a script. We can just copy paste this and we can run this. So, first we have to open Putty and I have already set the Wi-Fi IP address here and if you are connecting with Ethernet, you can use Raspberry Pi dot local and connect. Now I will copy this and paste it here. You can click yes. So if there is any already running node red, it will stop and remove the old version if it is available. Also remove the old version of node red as well as JS. And then it will install node JS. And these are the remaining steps. I will fast forward this. Now you can see the installation is done. It is asking for initialization. You can click enter and you want user security then yes username password so do you want to enable project feature then i'll say no for now and name of the flows is flows.json passphrase for your credential file so i'm using all as default now what we can do is we can use node red this should load node red so it has given the ip address but this is only local host to the raspberry pi now if i want to use it in my laptop which is in the same wi-fi network what i can do is i can use the ip address of the raspberry pi so how do i find that i already have the raspberry pi ip address so this is the Raspberry Pi IP address and I'll use the port that is 1880. Now it will ask the username password that we have set. So now you can see the node red has been loaded from Raspberry Pi. I can use a simple inject and debug node and connect. and deploy it. Now I can open the debug window and send the data. So it is trying to send me the timestamp. Now if you want to see this page on the Raspberry Pi, what you can do is you can use the real VNC and try to open the VNC server. Now you can see the Raspberry Pi desktop is opened and here under programming you can see node red has been installed and you can open any browser most probably you can use chromium or firefox so click on chromium now you can use localhost so when i use localhost 1880 it should open the node red page but this is not recommended to use node red in the browser of raspberry pi because it would be very slow so what we can do is simply use our laptop which is in the same network and work on this this way you can be fast and efficient that's all for today's video i hope this video was helpful if yes please type helpful in the comment section below your support means a lot to us and helps us keep creating more content like this. So please subscribe to the channel and like this video.
Thank you for watching and I'll see you in another interesting video.